the sum of the ages of a man and his daughter is 60 years. Six years ago, the man's age was thrice that of his daughter. Find their present ages. Let's start by saying, let M and D represent the present ages of the man and his daughter. So their sum is 60 years, so that M plus D equals 60 years. Six years ago, so daughter six years ago was D minus six and the man six years ago was m minus six the man's age was thrice that of his daughter's age so the man's age was three times daughter's age so we are asked to look for their present age which is m and d we solve this we have m minus 6 equals 3d minus 18. If we add 6 to both sides and subtract 3d from both sides, we have m minus 3d equals 6 minus 18 is minus 12. So we have to solve these two together and m plus d is 60. We can eliminate m by subtracting equation 1 from equation 2, if we subtract, m minus m is 0, d minus minus d, 3d is 4d, 16 minus minus 12 is 72, so that 4d equals 72, by the Bible side by 4, d will be 1 into 32 is 8, D will be 18. And so from M plus D equals 60, M will be 60 minus 18. So the father's age will be 42 years. So the man's age is 42 years. Data's age is. 18 years. V says, find the equation whose roots are minus 3 over 4 and 5 over 6. We are going to use, say, let alpha and beta represent the root so that if alpha is minus 3 over 4, beta is 5 over 6. Alpha plus beta is minus 3 over 4 plus 5 over 6. So if we sum this, the LCM is 12. 4 into 12 is 3. 3 times minus 3 is minus 9. Plus 6 into 12 is 2. 2 times 5 is 10. 10 minus 1 is 1 over 12. Their product, alpha beta, will be minus 3 over 4 times 5 over 6. 3 can cancel 6 2 times. So we have minus 5 over 8. So we recall the formula for the equation which is x squared minus the sum of the root x plus the product equals 0. x squared minus the sum of the root is 1 over 12, so 1 over 12x, and the product is minus 5 over 8, minus 5 over 8 equals 0. So if we multiply through by 24, which is the LCM, we have 24x squared, 
24 multiplied this 12 will cancel 24 will have minus 2x and this 8 will cancel 24 3 times minus 15 equals 0. So this is the quadratic equation whose root are minus 3 over 4 and 5 over 6. C says evaluate this. If we subtract this, 1 minus 144 over 169 is 169 times 1 is 169 minus 144, which is 25. So we we'll have 4, 25 over 169 raised to the power 1 over 2 times 2 over 3 to negative inverse is inverting this to be 13 over 2 to the power 1. And so this is same as square root. Square root of 25 is 5. And square root of 169 is 13 times 13 over 2. 13 can cancel 13. 2 can cancel 4 two times. And so we we'll have 2 times 5 is 10. So this is 10. <laughs>